What's today's best listing opportunity? Welcome to your Money Monday. Welcome to session 265. A lot of you have thought in the past that for sale by owners were a great listing opportunity. Expired listings were a great listing opportunity. So everyone knows the acronym FSBO, for sale by owner. But do you know what NOOS is, news? What is that? It's a great opportunity for you. Actually, it's non-owner occupied properties. So check out the non-owner occupieds. They're a great opportunity for you to be working to obtain properties to match your buyer's needs. It's crazy opportunity, folks. There's 138 million households in the United States. Out of that 138 million, there's 21 million investment properties. 21 million, that's 15%. Or every, you know, one and a half properties out of 10 are non-owner occupied, okay? So can you see a little bit of opportunity there that you could be missing? So check this out, take action. Number one, pull the list. Number two, add them to your database as NOOS is, okay, news, and mail them. Send the mailers to their primary residence. Pretty simple so far. For the first one, do a hand-addressed, hand-stamped, non-branded envelope and include your reviews and even a letter from the buyer that you're looking for. So put that in your very first one. Step four, make the calls. Follow the rules of do not call, of course, but go ahead and call the non-owner occupied sellers, okay? Then direct message them on social. Try to find them on social, direct message them, touch base with them. And here is actual script that you would uh, then have the conversation with them about. Hey John, Rich Mott's here. I sent you a letter about your property on Main Street did you receive it? As you watch values rise and properties trade at these crazy prices, have you considered trading that property up or cashing out? Would it be helpful to get an updated valuation on your home? I can send it to you via text or email. Okay, which is better? Then just say, while I'm doing that, do you own any other investment properties that you'd like new valuations on? It is that simple, folks. So remember this, the news, non-owner occupied. Great, great resource right now compared to for sale by owners, which, you know, are not, they're selling a lot themselves nowadays, but we'll have another talk about that and expired listings. There's no listings hardly expiring, you're going. So, you know, be resourceful. Don't blame the resources. Don't blame the low inventory and the high buyer demand right now be resourceful and go after the non-owner occupied properties, okay? I hope you like this video. The most important thing that you can do is take action and start going after those non-owner occupied. If you need the, the logistics of how to dive in and find the non-owner occupied, just reach out to me, okay? I'm Rich Mutz and I will see you next Money Monday. Thanks so much, everyone. Have a great day.